Lions are polygamous, with both sexes breeding throughout the year. However, females are usually restricted to the one or two adult males of their pride. In the wild, they usually breed no more than once in two years. Females are receptive to mating for three or four days within a widely variable reproductive cycle. During this time, a pair generally mates every 20 minus 30 minutes, with up to 50 copulations per 24 hours. Such extended copulation not only stimulates ovulation in the female, but also secures paternity for the male by excluding other males. The gestation period is about 108 days, and the litter size varies from 1 to 6 cubs, 2 to 4 being USCA. Newborn cubs are helpless and blind, and have a thick coat with dark spots that usually disappear with maturity. Lion cubs are typically born in secluded areas known as dens. Cubs are able to follow their mothers at about 3 months of age, and are weaned by 6 or 7 months. They begin participating in kills by 11 months, but probably cannot survive on their own till they are 2 years old. Although lionesses will nurse cubs other than their own, they are surprisingly inattentive mothers and often leave their cubs alone for up to 24 hours. There is a corresponding high mortality rate, but survival rates improve after the age of 2. In the wild, sexual maturity is reached at 3 or 4 years of age. Some female cubs remain within the pride when they attain sexual maturity, but others are forced out and join other prides or wander as nomads. Male cubs are expelled from the pride at about 3 years of age and become nomads until they are old enough to try to take over another pride. After age 5, many adult males remain nomads for life. Mating opportunities for nomad males are rare, and competition between male lions to defend a pride's territory and mate with the pride females is fierce. Cooperating partnerships of two to four males are more successful at maintaining tenure with the pride than individuals, and larger coalitions father more surviving offspring per male. If a new cohort of males is able to take over a pride, they will seek to kill young cubs served by their predecessors. This has the effect of shortening the time before the cubs' mothers are ready to mate again. Females attempt to prevent this infanticide by hiding or directly defending their cubs. Lionesses are generally more successful at protecting older cubs, as they would be leaving the pride sooner. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos.